I'm Dr. Richard McCann, exercise physiologist at Sport Northern Ireland Sports Institute. I'm currently working as the lead um, sports scientist with the senior Northern Ireland football team. The role of the team would basically revolve around three areas. So it's um, monitoring player readiness to train, assessing um, daily training load, and then facilitating recovery and fitness interventions with players within the squad. A typical day begins with first thing in the morning post breakfast what we'll do is we'll be analysing player readiness to train. So we have five or six um, subjective markers that we, we look at each day. When we arrive at the training ground, once the players are um, hooked up with their GPS monitors and their heart rate uh, monitors, then we'll have a brief chat with the manager and then one of my roles then is the um, facilitate player warm-up so that they're ready for the strenuous activity that, um, that the players are going to undertake during that training session. Based on the data that we get back from the heart rate and the GPS systems, then we can discuss and advise the management team about adjusting training loads for certain players to ensure the players are fully fit and fresh going in the games. Because this stage of season, it's not really about fitness for a lot of them, it's more about freshness and injury prevention. There was a bit of confidence going into the, the campaign. We were just hoping maybe we'd get the playoffs, maybe we'd, no, we'd do well, we'd we'll get the playoffs, have a chance to qualify. But then as the campaign went on, then picking up more wins, more wins, then it was, geez, we have a real good chance of qualifying automatically here. And then it culminated a game against Greece where we won 3-1. And that night after the game, I just remember feeling absolutely ecstatic. And then after the game, played Finland, we got the draw that actually ensured that we won the group, which was had never happened before from a team that was seated so low in the pot. So again, once the match was over, again, it was just a real whole buzz and excitement because Brilliant were qualified, but even better, we won the group. It was one of the best nights uh, of my life because you're part of that team and again, you go through thick and thin. I'll be supporting the team uh, while we participate in the European Championships in France. You want to make sure that the manager has the best team and the best squad, the fittest squad, the fittest team available to play three games in nine days. So again, we'll always be thinking, analysing and discussing with the, the other medical team how we can ensure that basically the manager has the best players the fittest players to choose from. Everybody's pulling that same direction. Everybody has that same goal, right? Let's get out of the group and then see where it takes us. It'll be a pinnacle of my career to date so far to be able to provide support to the team at an international competition.